Have you ever wondered if there's a hidden part of the internet where secrets are traded like currency? A place that exists just out of sight, yet impacts your life in ways you might never realize. There is, and it's called the dark web. This is a digital underworld operating beneath the surface of the internet you know. It's a shadowy network where your personal data, company secrets, and even access to your devices can be bought and sold. Here, information is a commodity, and privacy is a rare luxury. Most people never see it, but its reach is everywhere. The effects of the dark web ripple out into the real world, touching lives in unexpected ways. The dark web is built on anonymity, making it a haven for hackers. It's a place where identities are hidden and actions are difficult to trace. Imagine a hidden door in your home. Behind it, a bustling city you never knew existed. This secret world is always active, always evolving. That's the dark web compared to the internet you use every day. It's a parallel universe operating by its own rules. Hackers don't just stumble into this world. They train, learn, and acquire tools here. It's a community where skills are sharpened and knowledge is shared. The dark web is their resource center, offering a platform to collaborate and trade illicit goods with reduced risk of exposure. Transactions are hidden, and trust is built on reputation, not identity. Understanding this world is the first step to protecting yourself. Awareness is your best defense against unseen threats. The main draw for hackers? Anonymity. It's the shield that lets them operate in the shadows. With tools like the Tor browser, they become digital ghosts, moving through the web without leaving a trace. This cloak of invisibility lets them communicate, buy malware, and hire criminal services without revealing their identity. It's a world where trust is encrypted and danger is always present. Major data breaches and ransomware attacks often start here. The consequences can be devastating, affecting millions. To defend yourself, you need to know how this world works and why hackers are drawn to it. Knowledge is power in the digital age. Only by pulling back the curtain can we build real defenses. We must understand the threat to fight it. Let's step inside and see what really happens in the digital underground. The journey begins now. Are you ready to discover what lies beyond the hidden door? Before we go further, let's be absolutely clear. This content is for education, not instruction. It's about understanding, not enabling. Think of it like learning how a lock works so you can choose a better one, not so you can break in. Gaining insight into vulnerabilities helps you protect yourself and others, not exploit weaknesses. The world needs more ethical hackers and cybersecurity professionals, not more criminals. There's a growing demand for people who can protect, not attack. Choose wisely. The consequences are serious and permanent. A single mistake can follow you for years, impacting your life in ways you might not expect. Let's demystify the dark web, a term that's often misunderstood and surrounded by myths and intrigue. The internet is like an iceberg. What you see on the surface is just a fraction of what's really there. The surface web is what you use every day. Google, social media, news sites, and anything you can find with a regular search engine. Beneath that lies the deep web. This includes private emails, online banking, academic databases, and medical records. It's not sinister just hidden from public view for privacy and security. The dark web is a much smaller, intentionally concealed part of the deep web. It's only accessible with special software like the Tor browser, which is designed to keep users anonymous. Tor works by routing your internet traffic through multiple servers around the world, encrypting your data at every step. This makes it extremely difficult for anyone to trace your online activity back to you. Interestingly, Tor was originally developed by the US government for secure and private communication. Today, it's the backbone of the dark web's powerful anonymity. On the dark web, websites use strange, random-looking onion addresses. You can't just Google these sites or stumble upon them by accident. To access them, you need to know exactly where you're going, often by finding links in hidden forums, private chat rooms, or specialized directories. The dark web is highly fragmented, more like a network of scattered safe houses than a single bustling city. Each site is isolated and many are short-lived. Simply using Tor or visiting the dark web isn't illegal in most countries. However, its strong privacy features naturally attract those who want to hide their activities, including criminals. Here, hackers and cyber criminals operate with a sense of impunity, shielded from law enforcement by layers of encryption and anonymity. 
This environment is perfect for cybercrime to flourish, from illegal marketplaces to data breaches and ransomware attacks. Hackers connect, collaborate, and escalate their attacks from this hidden world, sharing tools, tips, and stolen data. The dark web isn't just a concept, it's a real daily threat that impacts individuals, businesses, and governments worldwide. Understanding how the dark web is structured is key to understanding the modern landscape of cybercrime and digital threats. Next, let's see how hackers use the dark web to their advantage and why it's so difficult to stop them. Picture a supermarket, but instead of groceries, the shelves are lined with hacking tools. Dark web marketplaces let hackers buy and sell everything from ransomware kits to phishing packages, often with user manuals and customer support. Transactions use cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin or Monero for extra anonymity. Sellers build reputations and buyers compare products just like on legitimate sites. Hackers can buy zero-day exploits, unknown software vulnerabilities, or even hire professionals for hacking as a service. This service model means anyone with cryptocurrency and bad intentions can launch attacks. No technical skill required. The dark web has democratized hacking, making powerful tools available to anyone. Stolen passwords, access to compromised networks and botnets are all for sale. This underground economy fuels global cybercrime, making the dark web essential for modern hackers. The dark web isn't just a marketplace, it's a hidden community. Countless forums and chat rooms let hackers share knowledge, discuss vulnerabilities, and refine attack techniques. Novices learn from veterans, accelerating the criminal learning curve. Tutorials, guides, and even malware source code are shared openly, spreading new attack methods quickly. Reputation is everything. Hackers gain status by sharing valuable discoveries, which can lead to exclusive group access. These forums are also where attacks are planned and coordinated, with members taking on specialized roles. The dark web provides secure communication for orchestrating complex operations. It's the virtual war room for cybercrime. How does a real-world attack unfold? Let's break it down. It often starts with buying stolen email and password lists from the dark web. Hackers use automated tools to try these credentials on other sites, a tactic called credential stuffing, with one valid password, they gain access and escalate privileges, aiming for admin control. Social engineering comes next, tricking employees into revealing more info or clicking malicious links. Malware is installed, giving deeper access to networks and devices, even webcams or security cameras. The intrusion becomes personal, creating real-world fear and paranoia. Finally, hackers monetize, selling stolen data or deploying ransomware for profit. Every step, from stolen credentials to final sale, is powered by the dark web. This is how digital breaches become real-world disasters. Hackers may seem untouchable, but that's a myth. Law enforcement agencies like the FBI and Europol have cybercrime units dedicated to tracking criminals on the dark web. They infiltrate forums, monitor marketplaces, and follow cryptocurrency trails. Major takedowns like the Silk Road prove that anonymity is often an illusion. The risks aren't just legal. The dark web is full of scams and betrayals. Hackers can be scammed, infected with malware, or even targeted by rivals. The criminal underworld is treacherous. No one is truly safe. A life of cybercrime leads to paranoia, broken relationships, and permanent consequences. The digital world offers better opportunities for those who use their skills for good. In the end, the house always wins. Now let's talk solutions. Good cybersecurity hygiene is your best defense. Use unique, strong passwords for every account. Consider a password manager. Enable two-factor authentication wherever possible. It blocks most automated attacks. Stay alert for phishing attempts. Never click suspicious links or share personal info. Always verify the sender and go directly to official websites if unsure. Keep your software updated. Patches close vulnerabilities hackers exploit. Proactive defense is key build layers of security to make yourself a harder target. These habits are your digital armor. Stay vigilant, and you'll be far less likely to fall victim. Cybersecurity is a never-ending cat-and-mouse game. As defenders adapt, so do attackers, often using the dark web as their R&D lab. The threat landscape changes constantly. What's secure today may be vulnerable tomorrow. You don't need to be an expert, but you must stay informed and proactive. Strong passwords. 
two-factor authentication, updates and phishing awareness are your foundation. These habits make you a less attractive target. Knowledge of hacker tactics empowers you to defend yourself, stay curious, keep learning and remain vigilant. The digital world isn't going away but you can navigate it safely. Stay safe and stay informed.